Okay. First question is obvious, I suppose. How and why did you first get into acting? Um, well, I came out of the Navy um, after the war, and uh, it was something I'd always wanted to do. And uh, there was a drama school started up at Bradford, and I went there at the age of uh, 21. How long you uh, just a year, and then I uh, started touring one night stands with the uh, uh, Arts Council in the north, and uh, then went on to weekly rep, then fortnightly rep, three weekly rep, and then came down to London eventually. Did equity cards exist? No, you just uh, went along, got a job, and uh, they told you you had to join. Mm. Yes. Um, the role I suppose you best remember for. Dr. Gordon. <laughs> yes, in Black Beauty. I think, I think mainly because there were so many of them. You know, I was in <laughs> 52 of them. Uh, okay. And uh, yes, we spent two years on it. We made one every week uh, throughout the summer months. What was that like? Oh, it was very nice because it was all uh, um, out in the open air and uh, no studio stuff at all. We yeah. just rented a farm, shot the interiors in the farm and the exteriors outside. How did you get the farm? Was it from the first person? Uh, yes, it was just they, they asked to see uh, several people they thought would be right for it, and um, uh, the America end of it uh, approved of my face, and we started filming right away. Uh, yes, it was a joint venture with an American firm, and uh, it was shown in America. Well, it's been shown just about everywhere in the world. Uh, going on to Dr. Who. Yes. How did you get the part? Uh, that's right, yes, yes. Uh, hmm? Must have been quite difficult by the thoughts of um, coming to that. Yes, it was. Uh, he, he died tragically, the, uh, the other actor, and uh, uh, they rang me up, uh, rang my agent up, and I got that again, I suppose, somebody somewhere, the director or producer or somebody. Uh, thought I could do it and rang me up and. Um, uh, oh, it was right away. I mean, they were due to start that that um, episode. Of what was it? I think it was four episodes. Yes, so, yes. Yes. And uh, so I uh, I just went and um, started right away. Yeah. Did you learn the script? Quickly? Uh, pretty quickly, yeah. Well, I mean, as quickly as anyone else would have had to learn it. Yes. It was simply that uh, I hadn't had it before. Mm -hmm. Uh, did you find your old chat challenging? Uh, no, not really. I mean, they're, they're fun to do because, uh, you know, <laughs> it's it's outrageous what you do. And uh, uh, I, I, I think the people who have the hardest job in it, certainly in that episode I saw, that I was concerned, they were the people playing the monsters. You know, yes. they had to be let out for oxygen every so often out of those dreadful costumes. <laughs> The story has received quite a lot of claim by the fans. Um, that particular story, yes, did it? Oh. oh, really? Season one of the oh, I didn't know that. Yes, so, um, what, what was your opinion of the story at the time? It was good. It was a workmanlike story. I mean, I, 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 to be perfectly honest, I haven't really seen Doctor Who yeah. before that, only bits of it here and there. Uh, my children were grown up really before it, you know, well, before it became popular. Yeah. Uh, they used to watch it a bit, I think, and um, I used to see it bits of it occasionally, as I say, and uh, it seemed a perfectly sound sort of um, um, way out story. Yeah. Yeah. Did you do any, any science fiction things before? No, no, I hadn't. Uh, oh, yeah, yes, I'd made a, a couple of films, I think, way back in the you know, 50s, 60s. Um, Night of the Big Heat was one. Where the, all started breaking up, and uh, I think there were one or two actually, one with Christopher Lee, I think. And um, I did a radio serial, an out of space yeah. radio serial for a year or so. The BBC. Yes, yes. So, Doctor wasn't your first? Uh, not my first expedition. Yeah. Um, yes, did you ever get to see a story on television? Uh, yes, I did. I saw, I s no, I saw. Th Two, I think I saw three parts, but mm -hmm. not one. I missed one part. You made the point of watching so um, Yes, I think uh, I think most actors do. They, uh, if, if it's more possible, but I, uh, most of my work's in the theatre now, and uh, it's not always possible. Really. Um, I've been amateur productions in video, and I don't think that's 
I don't know. <laughs> well, <laughs> um, yes, uh, I said, uh, I, I'm just not at home sufficiently long there, but I've spent my life in the theatre and on tour, and uh, you know, it's, uh, it's something that's never occurred to me. Um, you talked about the monsters. Yes. Story. What did you What did you think of them? Yes, they weren't as I'd imagined. They, you, know, you get all sorts of problems with those. I mean, they were supposed to strangle us, try and strangle us to death, and all that. And when they got inside the costumes, the arms were so small and they could hardly move them. You know, yeah. so you, you you have to accommodate the monster. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> they're they're not uh, usually. Uh, they're, Strong, uh, not exactly stunt men, yeah. but they're, they're people with stamina mm -hmm. who can yes. wear the costume and get around in it yes. without passing out. You know. Yes. Presumably that kind of role wouldn't be good to you. Uh, no, there doesn't seem much point in covering yeah. oneself up with <laughs> <in the> skin. <laughs> uh, yes, you probably heard about the, the cancellation. Of the yes, I did. Yes. Do you have any thoughts on that? Um, no, none at all. I, uh, yeah, I, I saw there was one put forward by a previous Doctor Who, um, Patty Trown, who said, yeah. well, it's, it's a gimmick on the, uh, uh, on the BBC's part to take one of their most popular programmes yeah. or so they get more money. <laughs> 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 I think Patrick <laughs> probably put his finger on it. It's quite true. It's supposed to be coming back, isn't it? Well, it's coming back next season, maybe next year. Oh, I see. And after that, the future's going to be really the week. Uh, it doesn't do well. I still don't understand if it doesn't do well. I mean, surely yeah. it's selling everywhere That's and being right. very popular. Yeah, I don't understand it, no. But then, I don't try to understand these things, you know. I'm concerned with playing the things yes. that they have. Uh, well, if asked, would you come back hmm? again to Doctor Who, if you asked? Oh, yes. Uh, yes, by all means, if, uh, if I'm free and, uh, you know, they want me, yeah. What about if the role of the Doctor is as the role of the doctor himself was offered to. Uh, yeah. Oh, yes, he was still alive at the end of it, wasn't he? I suppose he could, <laughs> he could come back. He said it would mean going back to that planet. I don't yes. know. I, I, I don't know whether they ever do that. Whether yeah. they ever return oh, well, to. I know the doctor, actually, the doctor who. Yes. Oh, the yes. Oh, yes, I, uh, yes I, would, I would have loved to have had a, yeah. yes, a year or so of that. But, yeah, Oh, no, 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 it'd be fun to do. Uh, I think the only snag is I think they rather insist you stay in it uh, a little longer than yeah. it might be good for one. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yes. Uh, no, probably going on tour with another play. Uh, there are another two plays I'm leaving at the moment. That's in the new year. Yeah. Oh, Not at all. Is it? Quite <laughs> famous. Thanks. Yes. yes.